Welcome to survivingebay.com. I put together a video series of 10 videos uh, on how to do just simple photographic cor corrections on items that you're trying to sell on eBay. You take the photograph and you'd like to put a watermark on it so somebody else doesn't steal that picture. Uh, you want to make it the right size so you can not only get enlarged but zoom feature. And that's really important if you're trying to sell on eBay. And how often do you get a photograph that's just sort of like all blue or all orange or all pink? I'm going to show you how to correct all those. So let's begin uh, by um, opening Photoshop and let's talk about how to make a watermark. It's very, very simple. The first thing we're going to do is go to File, New, and I'm going to make this 300 by 300 and you'll see it's 72 pixels that's fine for web uh, sites and here we go and what I want to do is make a watermark and move it onto here just like this so the first thing I do is go to my text and I can see my text is going to be red and maybe I want to change the color of that text to something more like let's make it a blue and I click here inside and you'll see it's made a new layer and I'm going to call this uh, mine is called uh, take the leap so I'm gonna put take the leap now I love, like the middle letter to be larger than the other letters so I'm now going to uh, go in and make just type this in and I'm going to make it um, 85 and there you go so now I have the logo that little text logo that I want or a watermark and I want to move it over here but before we do that let's go in and right click on the layer and let's go to blending options and let's try various things I like that I like that a lot I've just clicked on the drop shadow and the inner shadow now um, one of the things is this is sort of bright so if I take this right now I use the move tool and I take and move this over onto my item it's sort of bright it almost looks like it's part of the product so that's not what we want so here I'm going to go and delete that layer that I just added and let's go back to this now all we need to do to correct this and finish off our watermark is click on opacity be sure you've clicked on the TTL layer there and just switch that opacity way down and now let's go back to the move tool and move it on and there you go now that's a little too light so what we could do is again delete that layer and once you get this set up you just open this up and you have it exactly the way you want it there we go and that's pretty exact I think that's going to be good and there you go and I try to put it so it's on the background and the product so people don't confuse it as being for example if I put it here people could think that's part of the blue jeans so I put it down here and then you know it's a watermark and no one can steal your photograph that's how simple it is to make a watermark for a photograph on your eBay photos or for that uh, matter on your website so you know that people won't take that photo and use it on their website.